2007 Acura MDX outer door handle replacement. I'm Brian Essick from How To Automotive. I'm going to walk you through the steps of replacing that. So we're going to be using a genuine Honda exterior door handle. I will link this up in the description of the video. That way you can pick that up. To get started, we're going to remove the inner door panel and we're also going to make sure the window is rolled up. Using a flat blade screwdriver, we're going to pop this little panel behind the handle out. Then we'll remove the two Phillips screws. Now with a plastic panel popping tool, we're going to start at the top, twist and pull out, and work your way down the handle, pulling the clips out. Now that you got the plastic cover off, you're going to remove the Phillips screw here and here. Now with a panel popping tool, I'm going to stick it underneath the bottom of the door panel and pop the clips out every couple inches. And once you get those popped out, then you can stick your fingers in there and pull straight out until all the clips are. Now you're going to put your hands on the left and right side of the door panel and lift straight up and out towards you. Now we need to pop the inner cables off. And the way we're going to do that is with a flat blade screwdriver and pop the little doors open like this and pop the cables out. Now we need to remove the little plastic tabs that's holding cables down. And you're going to use a flat blade screwdriver on the bottom of it and there's a tab that you're going to pry up right here until it pops open. Now you can finish removing the cables completely. Once you get that done, you're going to follow the electrical connector down and unplug the window switch. The wire loom is also going to be held down with some clips that you're going to pop out. At the bottom of the door panel, there's going to be a light switch that you're going to unplug. Now we're going to pop out this little grommet right here. So we're going to unplug the electrical connector here, and then we're going to start pulling the weather barrier off. And I like to use a flat blade screwdriver and get it behind there and work it free and use your fingers to peel it back. Pop the clip holding the wire down out and pull the wire through the weather barrier and finish pulling it back. So now looking inside the door, we need to pop the rod that goes to the handle off by popping the clip off. And I like to use a flat blade screwdriver. Or if you're lucky, you can use your finger to pop the little clip open like this. Now that the clip is flipped open, we're going to take a pry tool like this and pry the rod out of the handle. Now that the rod is disconnected, we're going to take the 10 millimeter bolt out here and we're going to take the 10 millimeter bolt out here. I'm just going to use a quarter inch drive flex head ratchet and a 10 millimeter socket to remove those. Once you remove the bolt, you can remove the bracket that holds it on. And you're going to do that for both portions of the handle, inner and outer portion of it. Now on the outside of the door, we're going to pull the handle off like this. This handle was broken, so it came out in two pieces. So with the new handle, I wanted to demonstrate how the bracket is going to fit back on the new handle once it's inside the door. So we're going to stab the nose in in the inner part first like this. Now with your fingers, you want to press the handle lever down and then push the handle into the door. Now back in the inside, we're going to take the little bracket and put it over the handle that's closest to you and start the bolt. Now we're going to take the bracket that's furthest in and position it over the handle and start the bolt. Now you can go ahead and tighten the two 10 millimeter bolts, then take the rod and install it into the handle and make sure you flip the little clip over and lock it into place. Now we're going to take the cables and the electrical connectors and feed it back through the weather barrier and put, position it back in place. you are going to re-secure the plastic grommet and plug the electrical connector back in. Now on the door panel, we're going to plug the electrical connector for the light switch back in and the wire loom. Now we're ready to plug in the electrical connector for the window switch. Now we're going to take the white cable and plug it back into the bracket and push it in with our fingers. Now you're going to install the end of the cable in like this and close the little plastic door like that. Now you're going to take the gray cable install it into the plastic clip like this close the little plastic catch rotate the cable around into the plastic holder like this swing the door closed and push it down 
until the little plastic ear is underneath the silver portion of the clip. Now we're going to take the door panel and hook this little lip over the edge of the door. So you're going to take the panel and lift it up high and then lower it down over, to, over the lip and hook it. Now you're going to rotate the door panel down into position, look on the sides of the door panel and line up the clips and then push the door panel on by hand all the way around. Now you're going to install the two larger screws into the handle. Now we're ready to install the outer plastic cover and we're just going to line up all the clips, push it in by hand until you hear it all snap into place. Now we're ready to secure the two screws behind the handle. Then we'll take the little plastic cover and then open the handle up a little bit and push it in behind and lock it down. And that will complete the outer door handle on a 2007 Acura MDX. I'm Brian Essett from How To Automotive. I'd like to thank you guys for watching my videos. I encourage you to subscribe. I invite you to head over to the howtoautomotive.com website for more valuable videos like this. And also to remind you that I will be linking up the parts and tools that I use in the video in the description. Thank you again for watching.